Good morning. We're so glad you're here. We daily vlog. So if you like this video, come back tomorrow. Time to do our test to see if IVF worked. Our first beta. Can you guess where we are? It's a tradition now. Every time we go and we come here, we get good news afterwards. Yeah. So we're back at Market on South. All the good juju. Okay, we just ordered. Got this ginger ale. It's yummy. Oh, oh. This is literally the last breakfast item we haven't tried yet. But the red sauce that Tickler put on it didn't have it, so I got what they put on the hot toddies, which... <laughs> what are they called? <laughs> What are they called? They're not called the hot toddies. <laughs> <laughs> homies? Cheesy homies. <laughs> oh my gosh. The sauce they put the, on the cheesy homies, I, they had to put that on there instead. And then I got buffalo mac and cheese. <laughs> Sarah got the biscuits and gravy. Mm -hmm. Looking delicious. And garlic. I've been dreaming about this since the last time I had it. She like literally I literally was like, about it. And she literally like yesterday was like, do you think they'll make me a, a like an entree portion of the mac so and cheese? But we got our own mac and cheese, so no sharing. I'm just kidding. I need uh, some garlic in my life. Ooh, that was rich. <laughs> I like halfway. How do you feel, feel about your biscuits and gravy? Delicious. How do you feel about your garlic mac? Delicious. How do you feel about your ginger ale? Super delicious. My burrito? Pretty solid, pretty solid. I kind of wish that I could have put the buffalo sauce on there rather than the, the cheese homie sauce, but the cheese homie sauce is good. They have different stuff. Every time we come in here. He's stopping to smell the flowers. Ready to go home and wait for an email because we're getting an email. Yeah, but look at this delicious ginger. Whoopie pie. YOLO, whoopie pie. They call it YOLO. Oh. That I'm gonna eat in the car right now. Got my coffee, got my wife, got my wife. And that's my double chocolate chip. Guys, during work this week, I left on work on lunch and I came over here to look for an apartment, but uh, it didn't work out. It was not as nice as it was in the photos. <laughs> Hi, sleepy girl. How is it? Really good. You didn't even mention that I was wearing all black today. I don't know why. Trying to catch? No. <laughs> Every art student knows the power of an all black Ooh, outfit. Oh, <laughs> zesty. <sighs> Not too long after the last clip, got the email that the test was negative. So. We go back later next week to do uh, like an end of study paperwork and to talk about uh, next steps. We still mm -hmm. have uh, six more embryos. So thankful to have those, for sure. And we gotta be strong parents to those embryos <laughs> because they deserve strong parents. So we're gonna be going to a frozen transfer next. We'll learn more details, but... Um, Our doctor does prefer frozen. Yeah, there's so different I mean, kinds of benefits, but it's more of a waiting game because I think it'll be a minimum of two months. I don't know if we have to wait three months because of the the study we just have to learn more yeah but we'll learn more next week and share it this round of IVF did not work out failed but it wasn't a total failure no, we've got six strong good we made embryos. it through and we got to be a part of the study oh. and we got a care package sent to us like so Amazon now and Eve one of is, two of our really good friends yeah. who was actually my first boss when I moved down there who gave us our doctor Dr. Loy um, knew that we'd be getting the test results back around now and had already set up a little care package to get sent to us. Yeah, positive or negative. So we got some vegan cookies, special Whole Foods vegan blueberry muffins, chickpea puffs. Ice cream. Non-dairy Ben & Jerry's ice cream. Eve was here. That Eve didn't come in the package. And flowers. And beautiful white roses. So, it's not going to be, uh, this sucks. <laughs> Every procedure, every test, every thought that our doctors have, we're always hopeful that, you know, that's the end. That our Sarah's going to be done being poked and prodded. Then we can finally start our nine-month countdown. But not this month. But like we said, we got six embryos that we have to be strong for and confident yeah. and hopeful. We know it'll still happen. And we got to do that for them. So we will update you guys as... 
the appointments and everything go. Yeah. All right, Sarah, I've just finished editing like 90% of the vlog. Sarah's gonna finish the rest of 10%. She does the artist stuff intro. She checks to make sure I didn't leave anything not good in the vlog. Make sure my transitions are good, but I'm just gonna fix up these flowers really quick that came because back like a Peter's Green Thumb corner, um, it's always good when you get flowers like this to get fresh cuts on the stems, angled, what Sue taught me. Cut them at an angle, fresh cut before you put them in the vase. And oftentimes they come with food. So you fill this with fresh water, mix in the food, cut these at an angle, spruce them up then, that fresh cut gives it, lets it drink up extra fresh water to get a good fresh kick to them, just to help them last a little longer. So I'm gonna do that and then I'm just gonna chill. Here you are, cut and freshened up in a nice vase with some roast food in there. Now we're in self-therapy mode. We're gonna go get some plant-based sausage from Disney Springs we've been thinking oh, about. Oh, that's our plan? That's Not what so. we're gonna get? Not so as long as we have time. There's so many options. It's probably the we're quickest We're gonna go one see then. yesterday. That really, one of my, if you remember when we saw it a couple weeks ago, I said it was gonna be one of my top three favorites because it's just a feel-good movie. Mm -hmm. And then we're sitting in the car listening to music and Sarah switches a song all of a sudden and... He's like, what's this? She's my best friend, she's my wife, and she knows exactly what to do sometimes. And then it's... Put on some old-fashioned Christmas music. <laughs> That's just what we do sometimes. Alright, we're at BB Wolf Sausage Co. to see if the number nine, the vegetarian bratwurst sausage. It is not just vegetarian, but vegan. Sarah's checking our thesaurus known as Vegan Disney World. Swap bun for pita bread. Swap bun for pita bread. Okay, I can dig that. Talk that. And the same stuff. Okay. Can we get, and we, we get chips. chips. It's raining a little bit. What we've got. Smells delicious. Got some sauerkraut. Uh, German out. mustard. We missed out on pita at, whatchamacallit. Sana. Sana, yes. So I'm excited. Delicious. Hot. Uh -huh. We're gonna see about we only got 15 minutes till the till the um, trailers start. But we have to do something tonight. We're gonna go see if we have to do it before. If we have the time we'll do it before. If not, we'll do it after. But it's awesome because it's a little flashback, a little reunion, a little little anniversary. Oh, if you want to call it that. Of us living here. Of us living here. So I figured today would be, with what news we got earlier, we have until Sunday to do this, but I figured why not tonight? To kind of try to balance out the emotions of the day. Reviewing our annual passes. Oh, you said that I was going to show it! We're back in the theater. I'm curious to see if the, the trailers are going to be different this time around than last time. I don't think so. I think it's just like the same... It's all digital now, so and I feel like some of those movies have even come out since last time we saw. I don't know, we'll see. But we're gonna get a cold pop. I found out just now I got five dollars on my AMC Stubbs rewards, and I'm actually maybe one movie away from getting another five dollars, which probably means Sarah has five dollars. Because we do we go to the same amount of movies, so we should have the same amount of points. But I know one time we used only your points from your account. I wish we could just merge them, but yeah. I'm ranting because <laughs> my mind is just trying to going, 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 going. Let's smile. <laughs> this is what this whole movie is about is smiling and making us feel good. Yep. So let's go. I don't know if Sarah and I, if ever, have gone to the movies in Disney World and it, the sun still be out when we left. Right? That's the benefit of going to a 540 show yeah. instead of like an 830 or a 9 o'clock show. Right. Um, it's 8 o'clock. The movie was just as good the second time. Yeah, and just what we needed. I love a happy ending, and I needed, that's what we needed. Yeah. And so. I, just, I like the, the last song that he sings. She's oh, bloody, oh, blah, 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 blah. Yeah. But then it like talks about the family, and the home, and the kids, and yeah. everything is sweet. All the things that we're going to have, just in a matter of time. Yeah. So, I think a sugar boo visit, and then annual passes? Hold on, they've switched up some items here in our, our place, Sugarboo, and I have to show you this. A fairy diary. Look how cute this is. I think Sarah and I should write messages to each other in this. I don't know when Orange County Sheriff's Office arrived here at Disney Springs. Probably the same time around the fact that they added a Disney ticket center that I had no idea about. 
But now that we're going into year three of our annual passes, I feel like it's kind of like we've gone full circle. First year, we bought them over there at the guest relations. We got our annual passes. We are official Disney World annual pass holders. We have to order our Magic Vans and go to Magic Kingdom. Well, can, we, can we play with the idea of going to Magic Kingdom today? Play. See if our friend's gonna be, decide what she wants to do. Okay. If not, we'll think about it. If not, tomorrow? Yeah. Booyah! Or the next day, or the next day, or the next day. Or the next 364, th next 364 days. Yeah. Last year, we did them on International Gateway. And this year we're coming back to the Ticket Center and renewing our annual passes again. Wow, there they are. And because we're simplists now, we actually didn't keep last year's annual passes. Nope. So they took them, they're gonna... Peter originally said we wanted them and I was yeah. like... Ah. As I said yes, Sarah said no. Then I was like, yeah, you know what, no, it's fine. I got like, I got, like all nervous and stuff. Yeah. Um, what do you want to do? Head home? Do we, do? I, we never ate our ice cream. I kind of want our ice cream. Oh, at home? Yeah. Yeah, let's go home. We are home. Eve's getting Look at Eve's holding our annual passes. Thanks, Eve, for guarding those. It's from the package we showed you earlier chocolate fudge brownie non dairy and coffee caramel fudge non dairy. Um, we're going to make there's a vegan stamp. There's a vegan stamp we're gonna make on the vegan Whole Foods cookies. We're gonna make ice cream sandwiches again. And hopefully she doesn't get too mad while we're doing it because she can't have any. We're bouncing between Home Alone or P.S. I Love You. I think I'm gonna say P.S. I Love You. Because it's a good love story. It's a little bit of sad, a little bit of earth, worldly travel. I think everything we need. <laughs> um, do not eat my annual pass or my ice cream, please. Oh gosh. All right. We finished our ice cream. We're gonna watch P.S. I Love You. I'm gonna get up early tomorrow morning because I'm gonna be doing something fun. 26th is by Robert Frost. In three words, I can sum up everything I've learned about life. It goes on. I wanna thank all of you guys who have been sending in messages on Facebook, where we posted earlier that um, things didn't go as planned. Yes, and I'm trying to look and up the on quote. Instagram. Yes, there's a quote, a quote from the movie yesterday that we just saw, which was one of our new favorites. We already pre-ordered it, like we said. It just isn't out I until think August. You pre-ordered right? yes. it while I was asleep. <laughs> it doesn't come out till like streaming until October. But there's a quote that um, a famous Beatle. Um, performer tells the main character all right i couldn't find the exact quote i'm sure we'll find it eventually but i think i remembered it and sarah says it's pretty much right the one beetle tells the main actor that there's two main lessons in life to listen to he thinks and it's one tell the person you love them. that you love tell the person you love that you love them and at every chance you have tell the truth so mm -hmm. i love you sarah i love you too and we gotta be honest guys this is Rough one. It's not fun. And it's... Uh, no. Everybody gives us praise. Everybody gives us prayers and thoughts and loved ones send messages. You all send us messages. Uh, people who are going through this or have gone through this send us messages. But at the end of the day, this is still mine and Sarah's story. And it's it's not fun at times. And it's going to be all worth it. We know that. But we can't not tell the truth and say that at times it's funny and at times it's fun at other times it's exciting and other times it's depressing and other times there's frustration and then anger at things around us yeah. at the situation at nothing at all it's just it's tough yeah. so and we're struggling <laughs> yeah i mean like it's, it's warranted yeah. but we mm -hmm. are struggling so yeah. But we did get these today, so that's exciting. Yeah. Another year. Also, of... there was new previews at the beginning of yesterday. Yeah, that we didn't. That were different from the first time. Yeah. So I want to go back tomorrow and see it. Maybe we will. <laughs> <laughs> I just want it to be out. I love it. It makes yeah. me feel good. Mm -hmm. It's um, good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>